What's going on everybody? Z here and welcome back to some more Subnautica. So, in the last episode we checked out like the beginnings. The beginnings of the game. Super fantastic. All good times. But now we are going to go check out some uh, some other things. Um, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed, definitely leave a like if you haven't already. Don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. And if you missed the Twitch stream, well, do not worry because I'll have the live stream posted here probably today. By the time, probably today when this video comes out. So, um, yeah, okay. So we have our increased oxygen tank. We need food though. Yeah, we're going to need some food and some water because we're going to be gone for just a little bit. I don't like, I still do not like that top thing. Like, I don't really, I mean, I get it. Kind of like a little echolocator deal, but I don't know. I'm not a huge, not a huge fan of it. Anyways. So, uh, yeah, we are checking out this stuff and we're going to have a good time. All right. So, do, 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 I need, hey, look at it. Sea glide fragment. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I need food. What am I doing? I keep grabbing these guys. Well, it's probably always good to have a little extra water too. Yeah. Oh, Arctic peeper. Arctic peeper. Arctic peeper. Arctic peeper. Why would you do that? You Arctic peeper, you. You Arctic peeper. So, last episode we had the base, you know, collapsing and all that fun stuff. Um, I need food. I need to quit grabbing bladderfish and grabs, oh, but I'm gonna need them all anyways. I think we're gonna make a whole bunch of water. We're gonna make a ton of water. We're going through it super fast. You know what? We're just gonna make boomerangs. Let's get boomerangs. That's fine. Discovered. Actually, the hoop fish I think are actually pretty good too, and they're bioluminescent, so they're easy to find. <laughs> you guys can't run for me, no siree, no siree. All right, so we're gonna go check out this. Uh, oh, some graphical errors there. We got a message that there is an alien structure 200 meters below the twisty bridge. That's the wrong way. Oh, yeah, I'm aware. I am aware. Thank you. Okay. Uh, look at this area though. Oh my gosh. It is so nice. It is so nice. I love it. So, uh, yeah, 200 meters below the twisty bridges. We're gonna go check that guy out. Some pretty exciting things happen. Arctic peeper. Oh, did I get two? I got two. <laughs> I got two. All right, so let's get these guys all cooked up. I'm gonna make all this food and we'll head out. All right, we got some food. Let's go ahead and we'll consume some of these. Now, I did not cook up all the fish. Because I, if you leave them alive, they don't go bad. You just throw them in your inventory, they're good. You know, like you don't have to do anything with them. So, uh, we are going to head towards the Twisty Bridges, 200 meters below. And oh my gosh, some exciting stuff happens. Some exciting things happen. All right, so I believe we needed to head this way, right? Yeah, we got some weird graphical stuff going on. Also, thank you guys for all the comments and support on the first video. Uh, pretty exciting stuff. What? It just keeps flashing. I don't know what's going on. Is this not the right way? Weird. Oh, it's right here. I kind of like swam. What is going on with the flashing? That's so weird. I never had, I didn't have this issue last time I was playing, but I don't know. You know how it is. Early alpha, it's buggy and that's fine. I completely accept it. I'm not going to, I'm not going to bash him. I'm not going to bash him about it. All right. So we grabbed that guy last time. I also feel like the, uh, I don't know. It looks a little different. That guy's flying away. <laughs> just flying away. All right. So right here ish. Yeah. Um, is that it? No, maybe this is it right here. Okay, cause we got that. Let's go ahead and get some, uh, some oxygen out of these guys. Oxygen plant depleted. Is it through one of these maybe? I can't really remember. Ooh. feel like it is in here because we have this cave system and I feel like we got to go this way. Maybe not. Maybe, <laughs> maybe not. We're looking for a alien relic. That's what we're looking for. Uh, there should be one around here somewhere. There should be, should be. Keyword is should be. It's going to look like the, uh, the pillars from the like the uh, uh, the Lost River area. Wow, we are having like some weird framage going on here. Weird framage going on. Keep stuttering and stuff like crazy. It's terrible, awful, horrible disaster area. All right, so we came this way. Uh, we'll grab that one <laughs> because we're gonna have to go to the surface here before long. 
I was supposed to just like go straight to this place and you know do oh here we go. Are you on GPS, you're close to the sanctuary. Do you see anything? Some alien structures dotted about. I'll see where they lead. All right, we're following the alien structures. We're following them. So yeah, we got these things, these pillars right here, right? I need some oxygen here. Um, oh no, I don't. So yeah, check this out. Super cool. Let's go ahead and go right through here. We're good on oxygen. Oh yeah. All right, now we're gonna have some talking here. So I'm probably gonna be quiet for the next little bit. Once it starts, which will be eventually. Sooner or later. Robin Goodall, concede. I come in peace. Absence of hostility. Sufficient. Are you alive? Or a computer? What is the difference? I. I want to meet the people who built this place. What do you want? For you to stay here. With you? Forever. Why? Your masters will seek to harness my power. You've met Altera, then? It is what we would do. People will come for me. They will also stay here. That is all. I waited my life for this. I'm not your enemy. Hello? <laughs> so, um, yeah, basically wants to be best friends forever. BFFs? I don't know about that. I don't know if that's a good idea. It hit. Okay, we're good. Uh, okay, so let's go check out this area. Obviously, all of this precursor stuff looks very familiar. Very familiar indeed. And we got a super huge board cube looking thing. This is pretty sweet, I can't lie. What is this room for? Do not touch anything. I'm gonna touch it. Oh, he locked me in here. What a jerk die peacefully. Well, yeah, I'm gonna go touch this thing. I'm just gonna sit here and die and not touch a thing. You're crazy, man. You're crazy. Board cube thing. Big dealier. Actually, you know what? Let's just put that away for now. <gasps> oh, look at how sweet this is. Screenshot time. All right, that's good enough. Let's do it. Let's push the button. Initiate data download sequence. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Storage vessel found. Commencing download. Oh. I, I don't know if this is advertiser friendly content. I'm confused. I don't know what to do. <laughs> so, something just happened. Hey, we're alive. Hey, you yeah. Have no concept for what has just occurred. Oh, I know it hurt. What happened? Download capacity was identified in your cerebral cortex. You're in my head? It is uncomfortable. Return me. <laughs> Release the force fields first. Return me or I will destroy your orbital station. Why not do it now? My survival chance increases if I do not draw attention. I don't think you have the power. I think you're scared. Yeah, call him out. I will destroy you. No, you won't. I am experiencing technical difficulties. Do not move. Okay, let's see what happens if we don't move. Move. Errors. We didn't move. Hibernating. I didn't mean to scare you. <laughs> and he's gone. What is happening? He's just stuck in our head forever. Forever stuck in our head. <laughs> That's all right. We now have a friend that we can talk to all the time that knows our every thought. That's weird. That is a little weird. All right, let's head back out of here and uh, get some other things rolling. These bridges are pretty cool. So I get this, right? Like, okay, bridge here, they built this. But then this bit, this bridge is collapsed, which, okay, I mean, I get that. Sure. I, I get that. Mm. But where did the bridge go to? Like, there's there's nothing here. I mean, unless it came from like a nice smooth crossing right there. But yeah, you know, I, I don't know. <laughs> this isn't the same level as that. So I'm not exactly sure how that bridge really actually functioned. Why can't I go? Let's go. Huh? Huh? Okay, we're good. <laughs> Early game bugs. It's fine. 
All right, let's go ahead. Let's get out. Oh, geez. You know what? Let's just go ahead and swap the power. Hmm. We're going to have to swap this guy out. Yeah. And then we'll take this guy. Reload with that one. Okay. So, uh, yeah, we have a guy living in our head now. But what's good about this place is there is a ton of outcrops here. An absolute ton of them. So on the way out, actually, you know what? I do want to scan this guy. Oh, exchange power source. That's right. 11% should be fine. We'll scan this guy up. Ebi. Looks good. And I want to grab some of this stuff. Okay, we're good. And then, yeah, I'm going to grab a bunch of these. So I'm going to grab a ton of the stuff on the way out. And then uh, I'll meet you guys back at the... No, I won't because there's probably going to be a, some stuff that happens between then and now. So <laughs> never mind. I'm not going to meet you back at the base. Um... I'll bring you back once that stuff starts happening. We'll do that. All right, we're out of the cave, but I haven't heard any messages yet. So I'm kind of curious. I, th I thought we'd hear something. 30 seconds. Well, that's not the message I was looking for. I understand that I have no oxygen left. Um, nothing here. Wow, super buggy. <laughs> super laggy here. Okay, I just want to make sure we grab a whole bunch of stuff. Actually, inventory is looking actually not too bad. Um, I guess we'll grab this crystal and sulfur. Boop. Thank you. All right, let's start heading. inside the sanctuary. There we go. Yeah. Anything unusual? Like what? We're getting odd seconds. readings from your biometrics. Hmm. Malfunction, maybe? I want to make sure. We're sending down a disposable bioscanner. Take a sample and send it up in the cargo rocket. Okay, I'm on it. All right, so we got to take a sample and send it to the cargo rocket, which is pretty cool. Which is pretty neat. Um, home and this. Okay, they're both this way. I was like, wait a second. I don't know that these these things land in the same hey, spot every time. There. Oh, we're in trouble. If you send a sample, your masters will come for us. They'll do the same if I don't. Return me to the sanctuary. So you can trap me again? No. Then I will mask my presence. Initiate the scan. All right. So he's gonna hide himself. From us. Until, wait, where's the? Oh, here it is, okay. <laughs> I was like, where did it go? It's gone. <clears throat> now, I don't know if these land in the same spot every single time or not. Oh, man. One thing I do not like about these, actually, let's scan this. I don't think I scanned the last one. Maybe I did. Okay. Uh, one thing I don't like about this is I have to wait until it's like all the way down So we just kind of have to wait for it to land. I Don't know why you can't just pick it up while it's while it's coming down. I maybe future things Maybe future things you're kind of scary looking you look like a rabbit race cousin Hey look at there's some more uh, some more battery weed in there. <laughs> That's what they just call it battery weed Okay, can I have you? All right, perfect. Take that guy, looking good. And let's just go ahead and do our self scan. Sam, I've got the sample. Boop. Looks normal. And it's gone. Okay, good. Send it up ASAP. The cargo rocket should be on your HUD. Will do. Should be on the HUD. Signal location Boom, cargo rocket. Now, actually, can I even make it? Let's see here. We need to make the repair tool before we go over there. So I'm gonna tell you. You guys already went over there? You probably did. Honestly, everybody this probably got to this point at least already. We're going to make a repair tool. <laughs> because last time I had to make a repair tool and I didn't have the stuff to do it. And it was paint because I had to come all the way back. Uh, I believe it's just one silicone rubber. If I'm not mistaken, tools and repair tool. Perfect. Look at that. Nice. Okay, wait. Scan. Do I need to scan? I already scanned this. Didn't I scan this? Maybe I did not scan it. I didn't scan it, apparently. <laughs> I guess I guess we didn't scan it. All right. Um, so we're going to need another battery. We're going to need another battery for sure. At least one. At least one more battery. Like I said, we go through these things like crazy. Like hotcakes on a Sunday. I don't know. <laughs> um, can't really do anything else with those. I do have water. Let's go ahead and grab the peepers out of there and we'll cook those guys up. 
Because we're gonna, I don't want to get hungry while we're over there. Oh, we're about to see some cool stuff too. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, the cured might have been good too. Delicious. Absolutely delicious. I love me some fish. I love me some fish. All right, let's go ahead and drop all that stuff off. We have one battery with 100%. Maybe we should make another one. Let's make one more battery because I'd rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it, right? Absolutely. All right, so we got the repair tool. We're good to go. Do I have... Is there a battery in... <gasps> you know, if it was cheaper to make, you could totally steal the battery out of this because it doesn't require a battery to make it. It never required a battery. And we could essentially get free batteries out of it because what? Crystalline sulfur, silicone rubber, and copper? Was it copper? I don't remember. But um, let's head over to the cargo rocket with our wonderful little sea glide here that's super inefficient and uses so much power but we'll get there eventually oh we'll get there hey we got some bone sharks and we have an area that kind of looks like an area out of the the last area also there's a whole bunch of floating outcrops here uh, so there's a floating outcrop some of them are like where they're supposed to be but you know a, a lot of them are oh we got this dude too <laughs> this guy's kind of cool rock puncher I don't know if it actually does anything to you or not. I want to tame it and ride it. Let's get close to see if it does anything. Do you punch it? Oh, yeah, okay, okay. Okay, yeah, that guy, mm-hmm. Yes, that, <laughs> I don't know what I was expecting. Oh, I don't know what I was expecting there. Yeah, go ahead, comment away. I don't know what I was expecting. I was, I don't, I wasn't expecting him to get like punched in the face, but do I look like a rock? I mean, maybe? I guess, I guess I kind of do look like a rock, maybe. I don't know. Um, yeah, so we're on this amazing... Oh, check out these amazing untextured hot springs that they're working on. Yeah, right? They look super nice. Go in here for a nice swim. Take a dip. Nice warm water. I like it. So now we're going to make our way up to... I don't think I went this way before. Let's go this way instead. Hmm. This whole island looks different at night. Very interesting. Yeah, we're going the right way. Can't do anything with the lamps. I had people asking me in the stream about those lamps. Uh, I'm pretty sure we went this way. I feel like my voice just cracked. It probably did. <gasps> oh, look at a wonderful lightning storm. I, I don't know that it actually does anything to us right now. I imagine in the future because it did say that wind speeds uh, make it like super cold and wouldn't last four minutes. So I'm wondering if eventually we're gonna hit storms and we're not gonna be able to go out of the water which is kind of funny if you think about it the water's probably warmer <laughs> than the winds but check it out we got a sweet island like base thing here and guess what you can scan it all you i i did last time i i definitely scanned it all last time didn't i use fabricator unpowered locker empty this is the only locker that I've seen in this game. Oh, yeah, okay, so we got all the uh, the furnishings and stuff, I guess. Interesting. So, something I do want to try, we'll try it later. We'll try it later. No worries right now. We're going to go ahead and scan absolutely everything in here, though. Because why not? <laughs> why not? Um, I want you and you and you and scan the shelf. Let's scan the coffee maker. We're going to have to replace our battery because we're almost out of juice here. Oh, coffee maker. Coffee. <laughs> coffee ready. <laughs> However it says, I don't know. I don't know how it says it. But, uh, yeah, pretty sweet looking little area. Kind of, uh, kind of along the same lines of what we expected of last time. Man, these windows look sweet, though. Have the windows always looked that sweet? I think they did. Coffee completed. So cute. It's such a cute little voice. Okay. Uh, wait, it's still working. It's definitely still work. <laughs> oh, there, there it goes. All right, we'll swap that out and get these wall shelves. I was like, wait, this is still working without a battery. That's fantastic. And I think that's about everything. Now, you can't, unfortunately, go up in this thing. You can't access these. I couldn't go up there. Maybe if we just keep jumping? No, we're not going to get up there. Okay, that's fine. I didn't want to go up there anyways. Um... I also tried to do some like this action. It didn't work either. And I also tried to jump on here. I was like, huh? Oh, wait a second. 
I backed like right up to this thing. How did I do that? Oh. No. Huh? <coughs> no. No scanning options for us. Not allowed. Um, I don't think there's anything in the snow either though. Sounds like there's a hot spring nearby. Alright, so let's go up here. Let's do our thing. Let's do our thing. Check out that sweet rocket. That thing is pretty sweet. And you know what? I gotta say. We're doing all this for a sample of my blood. For a biomass sample. That whole thing. Okay, put that in there. And it's kind of cool, it says requested item bio scanner sample and to send. So I'm curious to see like in the future, we're probably gonna be doing some more things like this and they're gonna request, uh, you know, certain items and things like that. So that's gonna be pretty sweet. Oh, hey, oh, hey, there it goes. Hey, oh, <laughs> let's get over here. All of this for a biomass scan. Pretty sweet though. Uh, yeah, that's that's pretty cool. Wait, how does it get to? Payload inbound, Vespa. Understood. How does it get all the way over there? We'll come get you. Hey, why not take a couple days R and R up here anyway? Why don't you take a jaunt down here? Remind yourself that life comes in colors besides white, <laughs> off white, and gray. I don't feel like they get along very well. Below zero. No thanks. Below zero? You see that? Freezing to death. If you're staying on the ice, you'll need transport. You're trusting me with a snow fox. Wait, what? If I can find a version of the truth that authorizes it. You're amazing. If you're listening, Altera, she's amazing. Promote this person. Sorry, you're breaking up. Love you. <laughs> now what? Okay, I don't, what is this exchanger? So they talked about the snow fox. Unfortunately, I don't think we get it, but. Wait, what? Hold on, what happens? Interesting. I didn't realize you could do that. Waiting for cargo. Huh, I didn't realize you could use two titanium and make another rocket. That's pretty sweet. Did it come like out of here? Did it come like really super fast so I didn't even see it? So they're not requiring anything. Uh, what if we send them a cup of coffee? <laughs> <laughs> what would happen if we sent them coffee? I'm just curious. <laughs> that could be funny. Um, Neato. All right. Okay. Hold on. Let's uh, let's turn some beacons off here. Uh, emergency supply cache. Supply drop. Supply drop. Okay. So this, I believe, is our base. This is the first supply drop. This is the third. Okay, cool. I'm just trying to keep the beacons like in line so we'd know like what the heck is going on. Um, okay. Um, now. Hmm. Now we head back, I guess, because there's really nothing else for us to do here, unfortunately. Ooh, that's a really long ways down. Let's go this way instead. Ooh, diamond. Oh no. Inventory full? I don't think so. Uh, I don't really need salt. And titanium, I really do need though. I do need the titanium. I need everything. Uh, I guess we'll drop, we'll drop those. Okay. Uh, we're gonna grab some of the diamond while we're over here, because this is the first time I've actually seen diamond in person. Neat. Okay, so there's some diamond. Is there anything else like good? I mean, there's a ton of stuff over here, but I don't have any inventory space for anything, which is terrible, awful, horrible. Uh, rock puncher, dude. Hmm. You know, one thing I'm curious is what if there's magnetite over here because I believe magnetite was something else that we do need eventually. But I really haven't seen any of it. I really haven't explored this area a whole lot at all, really. Stop it, stupid bone shark. You stupid jerk faith. I'm also curious if there's going to be other other pieces of any uh, any wreckage either because like the propulsion cannon fragment I, I was surprised to see that. I was very surprised to see that. What's down here? Ports. Oh, hey, oh gosh, that scared me. I don't know why. There's another one. 
Oh, let's take, okay, this is the same area. All right, let's just head back. All right, we are just about home, and uh, I think that's gonna wrap up our episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed, if you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe as well. In next episode, we're gonna continue exploring, continue building, maybe? Maybe doing some building? So, uh, I don't know, we'll see. We shall see. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.